All right, welcome back. The Serial Cleaners playthrough continues. Okay, let's see. Keep yourself busy. Oh, I need to sleep. Okay, it's over here. I need to eat. <laughs> okay. I need a coffee. Another letter from Echo Killer. I know where you live. I will make your life a living hell. I will trap you in my labyrinth. I'll make you look at the world with my blood-stained eyes, etc., etc. Ah, he's the only person that writes to me. At least he's old-fashioned. Gotta commend him for sticking to the old ways, though. Oh, he's gonna double the severity of my headaches as soon as he switches to email. <laughs> Good point there. Let's see what's over here. Uh, some literature I've collected. Six volumes of books of blood. In cold blood. And blood meridian. I like my art to help me keep focused. Eyes on the prize. Cleaning time is over. Yes, sir. One must imagine Sisyphus happy. <sighs> oh, I need a shower. <laughs> Starry night. The things you can get in a yard sale. I still have no idea why I rubbed mom the wrong way. I was mad about it for quite some time. I mean, it's a damn good piece. Well, what are you gonna do? Ain't gonna find mom over such a trifle. I shoved the damn picture back in the closet and buttoned my lip. <laughs> Bless everyone who can sustain their self-denial without getting fed up with it every now and then. I, for one, can't blame those who can't. Nothing interesting in the newspapers. Wind from the south at 17 miles per hour. I need to hear somebody else's voice. It's actually perfectly normal for a man to talk to himself when he's living alone for too long. <laughs> you say so, dude. Uh, I'm not turning on the radio. Last time I did, they started talking about sports betting. Felt like being an alcoholic catching his first whiff of a good bourbon in 10 years. Cleaning time is over. Uh, okay. Guess we're doing a few of these loops. Ah, some stolen evidence that I kept as mementos. I don't keep anything that can be easily recognized as evidence, of course. I take other risks. I'm making enough risky moves without that. Talk about going against Don Rainer's wishes. But lives were saved that day. And that's a good thing. Still, I can't shake off the feeling that I've only postponed the inevitable. Now, let's check the newspaper. Oh, some 21st century predictions. Plagues, pollution, stagnation, fascism. Terrorism, wonderful, absolutely fucking wonderful. Scarily true. <laughs> a newspaper excerpt about Echo provoking yet another riot in prison. Six left dead. I hear they're using him as some sort of crime scene consultant sometimes. Taking him out in a cage. Wait, what? Why? I need a cigarette. Some say hell is other people. Me, I spent years in hell alone. It taught me to appreciate company. I can't lie, I'm fond of these punks. They are a mess, but mess is where I thrive. As long as it's rewarding to take care of it, right? The news says history has ended. A toast to all the efforts that made it seem this way, including ours. It's just that sometimes there are regrets. And the thing about having regrets is that they lead you to thinking the wrong things. And that led me to... Ah, who the heck is paging me at this time? Ah, forget it. I'll check it in a minute. 
Mitch Perhaps Milton? want me to talk about the time they saved me from the gates of hell. Not a fun story. But I own that one. Especially tonight. It's the dawn of a new era. For better or for worse. Okay. Two decades passed since the last time Bob heard the all-too-familiar voice on the phone. The Echo Killer escaped his cell with a clear goal in mind, involving Bob in a library manslaughter. The Murder Maestro rejoins the cleaning virtuoso for one last performance, their final chef d'oeuvre. Ah, uh, mon frere bien ami. Have you missed our carefree strolls through the gardens of lunacy? Jesus Christ. Give up the edgy serial killer as God stick, Echo. It's intellectually beneath you. The one who cleans obeys the one who defiles. I design the games you play. I am your God, bitch. <laughs> this is insanely embarrassing. You're like 60 years old. You've reached the cathedral of sin I've built just for you. Yet you still don't perceive the design. You know what? Shut the fuck up. You've been terrorizing me with those crappy monologues for decades. But this time, I'll set my vacuum cleaner to loud and simply get to work. Act your heart out now, bitch. <laughs> Wait, no! I'm just, I'm trying to... The Cathedral of Sin! What are you trying to... You're not even listening now! Hey, can you hear me? I said the Cathedral of Sin. Hey, what's going on? You're, now you're not even looking. You're just being rude. Hey, guys, let's go. Let's go. To your positions. Stick to the plan. SWAT will be here any minute now. Okay, let's see. What are we doing here? We need a key for this. Right. Right on time. Oh man, that's a lot of cops. Oh boy. all the blood out there.
Okay, now we have it. Um, still don't know where the drop-off point is. those spots, man. Five bodies and two more pieces of evidence, huh? don't see the drop-off point. Oh, there it is. to be joking. Wow. He just double backed to I don't know where. Well, at least the body counted. So, three bodies left. Okay, 
got all that blood. So here's another drop spot. I'm guessing the evidence and the other bodies are going to be downstairs. Well, except for the body up top over there. See what these guys route is. This one just goes here. And back this way. Takes care of the bodies. So now it's just that little bit of blood and the two pieces of evidence, and we are good. You can definitely tell that missions are getting progressively more challenging, but. That's a good thing. Because it's like a reasonable amount of challenging without, you know, becoming too tedious. is definitely much trickier than everything else.
How? How? Dude, I was literally on the stairs and he was below it. Like, under it. Okay. Especially these doors. Like, mm. All right, we can do this. We can do this. Looks like they found Echo, and they're saying, uh, he has tripped over his shoelaces while running away and fell into an open manhole, dying immediately? <laughs> he totally shot him, right? I spent a quarter of a century running away from the guy, and he just dies like that. So, what's the lesson here? You gotta confront your past. Police brutality is okay sometimes. Bob is adult. I don't like any of those. So let's just go with, if you survive another day, celebrate by drinking. F-N-A. 